guys, just for record, this is the bailiffs coming into the corner house. Um, so this is where we've been since February. We've got High Court coming down. Here at six o'clock this morning. Well done, Andy. Well done. Nice to know you got a spine, coward. Yeah, thank you, Andy, for the email and for the meeting. What we'd agreed to. What we thought we were going to have Clements and Thorpe. You're not going to see anybody else on the street. Um, seems a little bit hypocritical, wouldn't you say? And we now got empty rooms. Paul Dennett, Beth Knowles, Ivan Lewis, MP, <laughs> Labour. Empty rooms, mate. Well done, Labour Council. Nice to see you, Labour Council. Real opposition and they support the working class. This is what they do. Sure, as uh, head of the PCC. Support, uh, vulnerable people. And the new mayor. Yeah, you could have done more people. for this. Well done, guys. Well done for backing up. Good job. Great <laughs> points getting time on the street, innit? Yeah. So, don't worry, Andy. Yeah, Andy, we've got another building for you, so we'll just start again. Yeah. Uh, until you recognise the issue, mate, properly. Yo, Andy. <laughs> Andy. Yeah, that's sad, sad man. Sad, sad man. On a Sunday, 7 o'clock in the morning, another 20 people on the streets of Manchester again. It's a bit early, isn't it? Didn't even have time for the brew, Andy. Andy, this is me taking everything I fucking own, you prick. See you very soon. <laughs> very soon. Everyone here, everyone here will vouch for the fact that this is my stuff. So tomorrow when we come as homeless people and we have no ID, this is one of the reasons why we're homeless. So tomorrow the plan is to stand here laughing at us all in the street because we can't get our shit. And I will guarantee you now, Monday morning, you all sat here looking rather like, yeah, yeah, you've had a nice easy job. I guarantee I'll shut that shit down tomorrow and you know I'll do it. So you either let us in right now, say yes, right. your face, we no, know you're, stop you we'll be here. No, you no. can hear me out. <laughs> 10 o'clock tomorrow shot, morning, camera. we're back for our stuff. We're homeless you with no good. ID. We're homeless with no ID. No, you're going to listen. We're homeless with no ID. We'll be back at 10 o'clock for our stuff tomorrow. If you don't let us in, I will shut no, this down. Bad. Just, you know, all of yours. Your train tracks, your roads, yeah, the yeah, lot. I will shut it down. We want our stuff back at 10 o'clock tomorrow. No excuses. No excuses. Okay, we've been very patient allowing you to get your stuff out. We don't need a lecture. We've agreed that you no, can buy... I just want to guarantee you that I can come in at 10 o'clock tomorrow without ID. Because I don't have any. That's fine, we know you. That's what I just said, this man didn't say that. That's fine. Well, can we get that on camera? Don't need on camera. Yeah, we do need it on camera, camera because tomorrow yeah. we'll turn up and then there'll be station shut down. Yeah, I need your guarantee down. right now that without photo ID, I can come here tomorrow, have entry to the building, and take our stuff out. That's all I need, that guarantee. Because we don't have photo ID. Not a lot to ask for, is it? No, it's What's not. What's your problem? What have I said? I've already said. It's going to come back tomorrow. Without ID. Under appointment. The point is, without ID. I'll make an appointment right now, 10 o'clock in the morning. How many times? 10 o'clock in the morning. How many times? Yes or no? 10 o'clock in the morning. Can I turn up here without photo ID, because I don't have any, but I own everything in this building, and everyone here will accept me as a representative to come and collect their stuff for a minute. We have the vans, everything will be gone by tomorrow. I just need one cast iron guarantee that if I come back here without photo ID at 10 o'clock tomorrow, that we, the homeless people you are throwing back to the street, can collect our belongings. If you say yes, without photo ID we can collect it, then we're done. Are you finished? I'm finished. Yes, you can at 10 o'clock tomorrow on your own come back to get your stuff. On my own? To get your stuff, yes. So, on my own, how do I empty an entire building? Well, the entire building is your contents. The entire building, I'm the representative of everyone else. Yeah, my contents. You can, you can pick up your stuff now. tomorrow. All the stuff. All the stuff. Not yeah. just your my stuff. stuff. All the stuff. None of us have ID. Your stuff. My stuff. Everything That's in the building is my stuff, so you understand that? Your stuff. My stuff, everything in the building is my stuff. Because you just said it wasn't. My stuff, everyone, I'm a representative for everyone here. Okay, we're wasting time. We've got a No, we're not. We haven't got, got photo ID. We have an arrangement in place. 
We've accepted the fact you don't have ID. Right. We know who you are. Right. That's not an issue. Right. What is an issue now is that you're wasting time not filling your van up and we need you to go. So right, so can I come back tomorrow at 10 o'clock without no, photo ID? What at the time. Right, so... So if you're bringing your van back tomorrow and you're driving, that's fine. So you can come back at... Inspector Sturgeon not with you today, lads. Did right, you bottle it? Did you bottle it? Yeah. We thought right, you might. Trample, please, is it? We thought you might, Phil. Bill, 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 this is literally one year on, one year on, yeah, one year on. Apparently, I'm the head of the snake. This is a head with a lot of bodies, and I guess what happens when you chop one off, another one just appears in its bottom place. That's all the people you just put on the street, Andy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and they're only the people that were here today, mate. Uh, we've got other people that weren't here. And again, they're on the streets. This is what time we're we on? It's half seven in, on Sunday morning, Andy. Uh, I'm just wondering what you expect all these people to do, given your pledge to end homelessness by 2020. I'm um, going to take a laugh there. I'm going to take a laugh. Um, we'll just park up down here. So there you go, Andy. That's rough sleeping ended by 2020. Looks like you've got a new 15 bodies to help with that there. I figured it's a PCC and new mayor uh, and having people like Ivan Lewis, MP, Paul Denick, Salford, who's the strategic lead on solving home uh, housing. The, you might have had a little bit more balls than what you've just done today, bro. Um, I don't see that as your pledge being on it for one minute, not for one minute. Um, I see that's direct opposite act to your pledge you know i thought we were rather eloquent in the the, the mail that we sent you asking for clemency thought you might have had the decency to say that on board we met you in person we talked to you we're not completely not idiots just people that need help there are more more people that need help they need more help than us thought you might have been on board for that but clearly you're not